Hello everyone, welcome back. Today in this video, we will see how to fix error exception in thread main. Unexpected tag name exception element should have been select but was due. See, this is the beauty of Eclipse. It will nicely tell you what is the mistake you are doing. Mistake is unexpected tag, tag name exception. It means somewhere you are using tag name which you are not supposed to take it. And further, they are elaborating also. Element should have been select but was div. You should take select element but you are taking div. So in this uh, program, if you see, they are opening booking.com website and they are then clicking on flights and then they are selecting some drop downs. So this is business first and all. So See here, this exception is they are saying element should have been select. So it means you you should take select tag because it is a tag name exception, right? So you should take select tag, but it was div. So the problem is here. See, you all must be knowing when we take select class, we use select class for the drop down which has fixed values which has select tag in it so before uh, you take select class before you use select class you should always make sure in the code in the x path whether the tag name is select or not see here it is tag name is div so we'll see uh, what they are doing and whether this x path is correct or not right so let's copy paste this x path we will check in the browser what is the problem see here this is the drop, drop down i guess correct because here it's first class business or not so this is a drop down they are selecting for see select class we use for static drop down where values are static right so here we'll check what export they are using see this is the correct x path right but still if you run it will not work i will show you it will not work because you are supposed to use the element which has select tag you cannot use any other element which doesn't have select tag the only condition to use select class is to check whether you have select tag or not. See, the program is struck here. First, you would have noticed when it opened, it click on flights and then now no change. It was economy only and it did not perform any action. And see, we got this error because we have used div tag and select tag. So how to make sure whether you can use select tag or not, you should always check in the code whether the element has a select tag or not see here you use div that's what it was not working see this is the tag name this see here it has select so of course we can use select class here so now how to take this x path so we, we, we can utilize select class right so initially we are we were taking parent object right see this one we we were taking right if you don't use select class that is the correct x path but if you are using select class then you cannot use this because this tag is different it's not select right see here if you see it's all select so how we what we should do we have to take the x path of this one from this we should use x path we should always use x path with select in case if we are using select class so here as we have to use select 
will start from here. See, this is also highlighted. So, we'll write select. We'll copy paste this. At the right class. Let's see. See, it is highlighted. So now, as we have fixed this tag issue, it should work. Now, changing this to select class. And see here, first it will open booking.com, then it will click on clients, and then on this drop down, it will first select index first. So, which is the index first? Index first is premium economy because index always start from zero and then it should tell it should take business and then first class let's see whether it's following all these things or not i hope this time it should work as expected see it is initiating the browser browser is opening booking.com it is searching See, now it should click on flights. It clicked. Page is loading. See, it opened. First, it is economy. Over again, it happened. Let's see what happened. No, see. It worked. It changed. Initially, page load and all might have taken some time. But now it worked. If you have any doubts, I will again run the program and show you. Sometimes it takes time. So when you have some network issue or website is slow or something. But this time we will see carefully. We will wait for to get it load properly. See, now it should click on flights. I will click on flight. Now the next page will load. See, it is economy, first class, business, everything it selected. Now it started working. So hope this video will help you to fix the unexpected tag name issue. Thank you guys for uh, watching this video.